Yo, dude, are you going to school today or what? You know, the usual. Hey, I'm just trying to get by. I don't know, man. He's been acting funny lately. Anyway. Rob seems like he's avoiding me or something. Still trying to get paid. And trying to get my finals together so I can walk across that stage. You gonna leave Ethan's? Oh, you think I could be your replacement? Well, thanks for asking. And hey, they still got you on that same crazy schedule? Working on the weekends? Ah, so you working Saturday and Sunday? Oh, that's too bad. You missing a great party. Hey, let's take a shortcut. No, let's go now. That guy is... Hey, where y'all punks think y'all go? Oh, you think you tough, huh? My friend Mr. Beretta thinks we should shut up. Show him how we serve the disciples, fella. Aaron. We'll be seeing y'all again. I gotta go. Get the hell out of here. This isn't about you. Are you okay? You look awful. Did you get into a fight? Ooh, mommy's gonna be mad at you. You better not be fighting at school. Have you looked in the mirror? I'll get bandages. I told you not to call me that, you know? You always take such good care of me. I'm glad I can help you. Stay still. This might hurt. What you gonna tell Mama? Yeah. Oh, but then she might...
might not let us go to the park. But it still seems wrong. Yeah, okay. But you owe me. That's mommy. Hello, kids. I'm home. What have you got to take for dinner to... What is going on in here? Nothing, Mama. Aaron and I were just talking about his graduation. Sorry, hon. We don't have any more tickets. Oh, okay. Well, that was easy. Taylor, can you go and get the leftovers out of the fridge? But, Mom... No buts. Let's go to the kitchen. You okay? Sure, hon. You sure you don't want some dinner? Boy, that's a mother's job. I'll check on you in a couple hours. Yes. Can you clean up the living room? Oh, and I want you to clean up that mess you call a bedroom. Just a tiny bit. Gavin will want to go in there, and I don't want him to get lost in that black hole. That's the Bermuda Triangle in there, Mama. Oh, that was a good one. Before you leave, <laughs> okay, now that's enough jokes. Let's get to work. Don't forget to ask who it is before you open the door. Hello? Who is it? It's the big fat wolf. And if you don't open this door, <laughs> I'll blow your house down. It's Uncle Jordan! Hi, Uncle Jordan. Hi, Aunt Kayla. Hi, Gavin. Hey, 
Taylor, look at you. You must have grown a foot since the last time I saw you. I wish you'd tell Aaron that. Tater time. Hello, Aaron. Tired of being at the hospital, but it was good to see Dion. I'm going to the kitchen to help Maya. Stressed I at the moment. Good. You did right. I don't know. You might laugh. I promise. I won't. Dion I says he doesn't know, but then he don't tell us everything. He hasn't talked to you about any of this, has he? What y'all talking about? I'm talking about how Dion's doing well. I'm never gonna make mom and dad worry over me like Dion does. They worry it already. No, they don't. Settle down, you two. You've been telling your mom about this? You've been telling your mom about this? Don't make the same mistakes Dion has. So, how's the job working out? I'm glad to hear that you're helping your mom out. You know, these last few years have been real hard on her. I'm glad to hear that, son. But that is just a temporary fix. Without college, you can't go very far. Good. Now let's go check on the grub. How's the dinner coming? It's about ready, Billy. Get the kids washed up. You heard her. Go wash our hands. <laughs> <laughs> you might want to keep an eye on them. Say grace. Lord, we thank you for the food we are about to receive. Amen. 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 Well, Maya, I see you haven't lost your touch in the kitchen. Everything is delicious. It sure is, Aunt Maya. You're as good a cook as Mama. You got the two best cooks in Chicago in the kitchen, so what you expect? Guilty as charged, Kayla. I guess you could say it's a family tradition. All I know is that you two are in the wrong line of work. I put your food up against anybody's. Those compliments will not get you bigger slices of steak. Please, we're just one step ahead of the bill collectors. Didn't I tell you to let me know if you needed some help? If I had needed to, I would have. You can accept help from your own brother, can't you? 
Yes, but who said that we needed help? I know that this dinner must have cost you a pretty penny. Man, between the sales items and the coupons I clipped, I saved a ton. And with the help of my son, who's becoming a fine man, we're doing all right. Well, it's getting so an honest man can't make a living. We squeeze between unemployment and inflation. That's because kids spend too much time in front of the TV instead of reading. That's sad. Back in the day, all kids looked up to their parents. What about the dream of becoming a doctor or lawyer? So if I understand you right, these gangsters are the role models for y'all. I can't stand rap music. Charles Barkley said once, he shouldn't have to be a role model for your kids. Yes, because parents should be teaching kids values. I see him on the bus every day, cussing like sailors, sitting down while old women stand. Well, sometimes you can teach the right things, and your kids will still do the wrong things. Sounds like you're talking about Dion. No, not necessarily. I know you don't want to get upset, but we need to talk about it. Tell you what, sis. I'll call you tomorrow, and we'll have a long talk. That would be great, girl. You know how I feel. I keep trying to tell Kate. It ain't helping for her to keep beating herself up over this. Hey, I've been wanting to ask Aaron about the poetry slam. writing after I read a book of poetry by Langston Hughes. Poetry slams are cool, and Aaron's the best. You should really see him. competition this week. Why don't you perform one of your poems for us? We should go. We'll figure out what's going on Monday and let you know. I'll be there. Mom, do you have to work late Monday? I'm not sure. We'll see. can be ready for the next one. For real? Awesome! You've done a great job with both of these kids, Maya. I'm proud of you. 
Thanks, Jordan. Now, before I put the food away, did everybody get enough to eat? Hey, Aaron, can I see some more of your stuff? I've been trying to write, but I, I'd be scared to show them. Okay, just a sec, Dad. Please, I got two healthy assistants. We got it handled. Well, bye, we enjoyed ourselves. Now it's time for us to get in the wind. I'm so glad y'all came. We need to do it again soon. You sure you don't want help cleaning up, Maya? It is a great dinner, Aunt Maya. All right. Thank you again. Have a good night. We should get together after graduation. It'll be like a mini reunion. That'll work. Bye. See y'all soon. Now, Taylor, go get a start on your homework. Mom, I have all tomorrow to do it. The more you get done before bed, the better. Now get started. I'll be in to help you in a bit. No, son, we can clean up tomorrow. I'm worried about you. Yesterday, you looked sick. I can't have you getting sick before finals. Get some sleep and we can clean up tomorrow. <laughs> 